Welcome back, Pioneers. We hope you had an incredible weekend. Today is Monday, April 15, 2019. It's time for News in the Morning with your WPKN News Team starring Zion Perez with his Pledge of Allegiance, Madeline Garcia with the weather, Caitlin Pagnosi with the school expectations, and Miss White with the Pioneer Minutes. I'm Casey DeCesar. And I'm Leah Perrine with today's news. But first, let's all stand and join Zion for the Pledge of Allegiance. Zion. Good morning, Pioneers. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day. Now back to our anchors. Awesome job, Zion. Now let's join Caitlin with our school expectations. Caitlin? Good morning, Pioneers. Please repeat the school expectations with me. We will be responsible, we will be respectful, we will be safe, and we will be leaders. Thank you, and back to our anchors. Information, Caitlin. Now let's join with, in with Madeline, who's in the WPKN Weather Studio with a look at today's forecast. Madeline? Good morning, Pioneers. Today's weather will be sunny with a 0% chance of rain. The wind will be blowing from the northwest at 11 miles per hour. The humidity will be 52. The high today will be 77 with a low of 49. Okay. Have a great day. Now back to our anchors. Nice weather update, Madeline. For lunch today, our fabulous Romeo chefs have prepared for us a choice of cheese sticks or mini hot dogs with broccoli and fresh fruit. Don't forget your choice of milk. For Pioneer Minutes with Miss White with today's school ex- announcements. Take it away, Miss White. Pioneers and happy Monday. I hope everyone had a fantastic weekend. I know a lot of you went out to Boomtown Days. Uh, we did see some people at the Literacy Festival, so I hope that you were able to get out and have some fun. We are starting off this week with a great announcement that we are at 100% on our buses. That's a fantastic way to start this week. That's bus 3025, 3031, 3028. 3024, 3077, 3005, 3007, 3035, 3037, and 3029. That is fantastic, boys and girls. Remember, we want to do this every single day. Remember, kindness is a muscle, and that includes school, home, bus, wherever you are. Treat each other with kindness. Now, I have some special guests today. Coming on right now is Mr. Gabriel Torres. Come on, Gabriel. Gabriel was published in the Star Banner. Gabriel, who's your teacher? All right. Would you read for us what you wrote to Matt? Dear Matt, the the flavor of ice cream that I like the most is bubble gum. It is tasty, and I eat it in chocolate cone. Your friend, Gabriel Torres, Gregory Romeo Elementary. That is fantastic. Gabriel, here, hold up your shirt so everybody can see that shirt that you have gained earned for being a part of Matt Manatee. Boys and girls, you too can get published on Matt Manatee, just like Gabriel. Last week we had Jamie Teague who was published. So this week, the title for your letters are is house building. What kind of house do you want to build and live in? So write those letters to Matt Manatee, draw an illustration if you choose. Make sure that you put your name, your grade, your school on there to help make Romeo world famous. Great job. If you'll head off that way, Gabriel. All right, next I have some very special guests. <coughs> And as they're coming on, this has to do with our bus boards. We're bringing up some of our bus leaders today. Come on in here. Let's get everybody in. I'm going to scooch this way. Scooch, scooch, scooch. All right, come on in. And come on in this way. We're going to zoom out. Come in right in between. There we go. I'm going to pass this around. I want you guys to tell us your name and your teacher's name. My name is Lucero, and my teacher's Miss Lamb. My name is Leilani, and my teacher is Ms. Hedevig. Okay. My name is Ruben, and my teacher name is um, Mrs. Moore. I'm Mika, and my teacher is Ms. Dunn. I'm Janicia, and my teacher is Ms. Holland. 
Fantastic. Just go ahead and hold on to that for us. Boys and girls, the reason I have these spectacular boys and girls up here, they are all from bus 3031. Now, if you'll recall on Friday, we said 3031 had had an issue on Thursday afternoon. Miss Ashley, their driver, was not feeling well and was very sick. And these boys and girls stepped up. They became true leaders on their bus. As soon as they noticed that there was a problem and the driver was not doing well, they sprang into action. They stood up. They walked around. They made sure everybody was quiet, staying in their seats and monitoring. And who was it? Somebody was actually helping Miss Ashley, wasn't uh, Standing over Miss Ashley, passing her some tissues and comforting her because Miss Ashley got really sick to her stomach and had to pull over. And these girls and young man stood up, were a leader, and took charge. Guys, great job. We expect that of all of our students. And not only did you lead well, but everybody else on the bus was following your direction, weren't they? They were following. So if you're on bus 3031, great job. I am so proud of each of you. Fifth graders standing up, doing what's right, and being that leader. This is what we want all of our students to be here. Leaders whenever the time comes. So great job standing up and doing what you're supposed to do. We are so proud of you girls and young men. Great job. Okay, guys, head on out for us. We just have one more announcement. Boys and girls, remember that I ready diagnostic. We are still finishing up our math diagnostic, but the reading diagnostic is also opened up today. This is especially important for our fifth graders and our third graders. Fifth grade. This diagnostic will help determine some of your classes next year in middle school. It is extremely important that you do your very best. We don't want to have you to go into a class that's teaching you stuff you already know. We want you to make sure that you are doing exactly what you should. So take that I Ready Diagnostic seriously. Uh, third grade, this is another way to get promoted into fourth grade. So I need you to take your time as well. Do your very best. And for everybody out there, we have tickets on the line. So if you show that one year's growth in one year's time, you'll get a ticket for a special treat at field day. If you make your stretch growth, you get the tickets and the pizza and playground party with Miss Bayless, myself, and Miss Williams. So take this seriously. Do your best. We're seeing some great growth out there. This is your time to shine. Boys and girls, have a fantastic week. Remember, choose kindness and be that leader, just like this group that was up here from Bus 3031. We believe in you. Have a great day. Back to our anchors. Thank you, Ms. White. Well, that's all for today, Pioneers. Thanks for joining us this morning. Be sure to tune in again tomorrow for the news that kids can count on the start their day. I'm Casey DeCesar. And I'm Leah Perrine. Until next time, see you later. Bye for now.